Chocolate sauce. Australians. No, not that. <laughs> Australian chocolate Australians. That sounds really bad. Uh, Something to do with Australian chocolate, is it? Welling with joy to be here with you. You know, I'm really excited. Just as long as the next thing we try isn't chocolate based. If it had someone's name in it as well, it'd be That'd done, be wouldn't it? Yeah. Australian chocolates. Uh, if you cannot already tell from my accent, it's just kind of South African as well. I wonder, really. I wonder if chocolate. it's like, like as sweet as American chocolate. That's what I'm going to be interested to see. Because Irish chocolate is pretty good. So it's going to be interesting to see what the Australians take on chocolate. Is. Um, so where, how exactly do you ingest these? Daryl Lee. Uh, are, are we sure it's not like Daryl Lee? Because <laughs> these look distinctly suppository shaped. They do. Oh my God. If you put this up, up your bum, like it would. Oh, like I don't like anything going near my bum, but this is tempting. Bullets. It's very no. aggressive. Oh thing no, chocolate, licorice, licorice. I hate licorice. I hate it already. Can I get that over the mic? I wonder. In one. There we go. Oh, you got it in there. I got it. I got it in there. Just keep it there. It looks great. <laughs> That's what Christ. came out of your mind in that scene in Train Spotting where you could swim down the toilet oh. to get the back. I, I caught a bowl between my teeth and I sound funny now. Yeah. I think I like it. Mm hmm. It's licorice in the. Yeah. It doesn't even taste very licorice. It's not as bad as it was. It's not as licorice yeah. as it would be. What? They're real good. What a twist. Yeah. I stopped myself. I was going to say I really like it. And then I was worried about Tom's opinion. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh no. Your opinion is valid. Don't know if I'd go out my way to buy them. No, I wouldn't go to Australia now for a pack. <laughs> Dara Lee, you little, you minx. Uh -huh. I really like the chocolate. I don't like the licorice. If you grew up with them, you might be like, oh, give me a Dara Lee. <laughs> Love a Dara Lee. Dara Lee bullet does sound like a sex toy. It tastes like medicine. Licorice has always tasted like medicine to me. Yeah, I understand. A regular chocolate bullet. You know, that we have all of the time. <laughs> it's for shooting those chocolate werewolves. <laughs> hey! That was loud. Ooh, nice one. Caramel clouds? I mean, what makes them clouds? You know they're good. You know it's a good try shooting when uh, most of it's been eaten by the other people. That's a good chat, yeah. Yeah. Float away with Daryl Lee's caramel clouds. <laughs> Chewy caramel balls. Don't laugh because I said balls. Chewy caramel balls covered in milk chocolate. The key in milk though, that set the whole thing off there, didn't it? Yeah, milk. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Hum. They're so good. Daryl crushing it. It's just great work. They're on caramel Maltesers. And I'm meant to be hard. <laughs> They're quite soft. They are not caramel Maltesers. They're okay. chewy. Maltesers are crispy. Yeah, but that's what the caramel comes in. Can we try it at the same time? Okay. One, two, three. Clouds aren't soft. They're more like fudge, aren't they? They're more like fudgy, soft and Clouds fudgy. tend to be soft. I really like that now. Yeah, it's nice. They're like God's marbles. They're very different, but... They're also very, very good. Very good. I kind of, they were nice. I don't know, I wasn't mad about them. Like, they were grand. Mega minty moments! Wait, what? Bigger, better milk chocolate mint balls. This is the opposite of what I was expecting. I was expecting it to be like chocolate again on the outside, but with the mint on the inside. They look like apples, not mint. They look very green, actually, very, yeah. It's too green. I guess it's supposed to be mint leaf, but it really does look like an apple. They're so green. There's some minty balls. And they're bigger than the other ones. Look at my ass. This is confusing my brain, because I'm expecting it to be chewing gum. Oh, they're, they're really good. They're nice. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh. They're nice, it can be a bit mint. Mintier for me. I always said that Darley has very palatable balls. It's a lot to chew. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it just keeps yeah. going. I'm not mad about the shell. No. But like, you're pretty good. Now I understand why like M&Ms and Smarties are the size that they are. You can be there forever. I was gonna try and throw it up and catch it in my mouth, but you don't want Darley's balls in your chin. I honestly feel like my jaw needs a rest. There's a nice amount of chocolate relative to the amount of shell. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'd say they're nice, but they, they actually are a legit jaw workout. It's like, very hard, the, the job that we do here, you know? 
punchy peanut butter brittle balls. Noisy, nutty, brittle. So I take it they're gonna be loud. <laughs> Noisy, nutty, brittle balls. Noisy, nutty, nutty brittle, brittle balls. <laughs> like the doctor phones you up. Oh, you mean like the STI clinic rings you? Yeah. <laughs> You're actually Not on again. a list of previous partners here from Tom's <laughs> Got Brittle Balls. I like there's also a lot of variation. It's not just, oh, we've got the same product. Let's just fill the center different. Like, mmm. You can't hear it, but inside it's like <laughs> Yeah. A textural surprise. Mm -hmm. They're not as good. I think it's because you said caramel before and then it wasn't. And then it was like, oh, hello, a surprise in my mouth. I'd say a dentist would hate these. You're really into peanut butter? I'm sure they'd be your jam. Like I swallowed half of it and the other half is in my teeth. They're really, I think the filling comes mm -hmm. in. It's crunchier than you expect, but the flavor is lovely. These are the, 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 the least good ones. Mm. Do we have Fine. a dentist? <laughs> Can we get a dentist? Ow! Oh God. Daryl, he, he just, he's a simple man, he does what he says. He's been bang on with the descriptions. There's no secrets or surprises. It's like, here's exactly what you're putting in your mouth. Pink? Oh. Oh, more suppositories. If something's pink, I'm like, 78% more likely to put up my bum. I didn't know it was like a new type of chocolate. I just thought it was people dying chocolate pink. What? Ruby chocolate's a type of chocolate? Ruby chocolate raspberry, you monster. We're in a weirdo end to this, so there is. They look like little dicks or something. I don't know. All right. <laughs> welded mini penis. <laughs> Would you like a welded mini penis? The color is unnerving. I totally agree. I'm a little bit nervous. Do we have insurance? Very nice. I'll just put it straight in. Yeah. Oh, this is troubling. Ah. Oh. It's not that it tastes bad, it's just that the experience is so troubling. They're really good. Yeah. I feel like my mouth has been haunted. Really disturbing. They're not nice, and they look disgusting. I know what the difference is. And it's grey and pink, mm -hmm. so you don't want to eat it already. Mm -hmm. And then it's just unusual. It's things like this justify leaving space for a 10 out of 10. Oh, that's probably the most disgusting piece of chocolate I've ever, ever seen. seen in my entire life. <laughs> Anytime like chocolate attempts fruit, I'm like, go fuck yourself. You kind of stand. Oh, no! <laughs> I could see it being like in my local shop and me picking up those sweets. Yeah, there was something like wholesome about it. I think you could extend the bullets to like, you know, different like sniper. Different uh, like a 35 mil. Yeah. 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 I think we got a laugh. It was an exciting it was, experience. It was interesting yeah. to see the level of sexual overtones that Daryl Lee's marketing and product yeah. development team could put into one pack of chocolate. If you don't like and subscribe, you'll get a bootin'. And nobody wants to get a bootin'. So like, subscribe, tell your friends, follow all of us on social media, including the channel, obviously. Uh, exciting things to come in the future. Huh?